You can see it ripple. Sharpshooter? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no hats. No shades. No drawers. No fear. No problem. Cowboy. Death before dishonor. You gonna put that one in here? Yeah. Is that like a 15 or something? Here, I'll get you gloves. 95% of these turn loose, but if somebody wants one, but you want one? Yeah. That's a heater. You can just catch them and turn them right back loose. But you got nothing against somebody who wants a clean one. That's a good one. Main one.
That's the way I'd do it if I did it. What's it got? 3304. That's a female too. She's full of eggs. Guesstimate on that one? 22. That's what I was going to say, 22. Twenty point three. Your turn. I'll edit that part. Mode abuse. I'll edit all this way. Just take your time. Golly. 2114, call it. 220 is a 33, and this one here is probably, I guess, 15. It, it, yeah, that's about a 15. That's one I ought to eat. 617, call it 17. 17. Always release them. There she goes. Stick it. Don't set that one in there. I'm keeping him, right? I'm a bad person if I pee right now. Nah, let her loose. Oh, it just about broke my ass. Well, that one weighed 20. 20. Pick it up one time, Wade, before we set her loose. Yeah. Look. The belly looked as dirty as yours. You see that? I know. But I hadn't been laying on a mud flat. Y'all better keep it in your shorts, she'll get revenge. I mean, I had leg completely blocked, and he just 
got just powered through it. And just once he got that nose, he just powered through it. Did it get a hold of you? He just mashed me up against that rock. <clears throat> There's a slip in. I don't know if we should rope him or throw him up in there. I got your spot cleared out if you want to roll him in. Huh? I'm he's, he's a good fish. Here, Ryan. Here, I'll throw it to you. All right, he's got the rope on him. Man, that's a whopper. I think there's one more. Check and see. While they're out there looking for number seven, I'll give you the lowdown. I don't noodle, but I know guys that do. And I just wanted y'all to see what they could do. They're doing pretty good. You don't have to whisper. The reason I'm editing this video the way that I am is because Wade's part of Special Forces and he can't have his full face shown on camera. That beard is just a disguise. He's, he's, <laughs> I can see Ryan and I can see half of Wade's eye peeking around the back of him. On kilograms. Yeah. Forty forty five one seven. Yeah, let's call it forty five. Wow. Whenever you're ready. Well, I'm almost home. Let me recap this video for you. I haven't said much in the video. And uh, I mainly just tried to show you what Ryan and Wade do in the summer. And they're good at it. And they do it a lot. And uh, I don't do it. I don't want to go getting underwater, sticking my hands up in there with mean fish, trying to protect their babies. But I thought y'all might enjoy seeing it done. Some of you haven't ever seen 
noodling or hogging or grabbing or hillbilly hand fishing, whatever you want to call it, depending on what part of the country you live in, um, they've been doing it a long time. Ryan especially, Wade's been doing it with him. I've known those guys for years. I, um, Ryan was the best man in my wedding almost 25 years ago. I've known Wade since we were in junior high. We used to trap together when we were in high school. So uh, I just appreciate them letting me tag along and, and video it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We ended up with seven, uh, six. One of them got away. We should have had seven. We ended up with six catfish. And uh, they asked me if I wanted to keep the littlest one, which was, I think, I don't know, 15 or 17 pounds. So I did. And I, I got to get home and get this fish clean. So uh, this will wrap up the video. I got work to do and fish for the freezer. See you guys on the next one.